Big Boys Neighborhood, Ricky Martinez here with Tyga. We're at Powerhouse 2012. Tyga, you're gonna take the stage in a little bit. How exciting is it for you just to be in Los Angeles? Yo, you're from West Coast, West Coast grown. How is it, man? I'm excited, man. Like, I got a lot of adrenaline. I've been here all day, you know what I'm saying? Just to see everybody and just to see, you know what I'm saying, LA shining and really just doing something at this level, you know what I mean? Real quick, me and Big were kind of observing you. You could call us creepers, but while you were eating, and we saw the hype on you, like just the excitement that you have for this, and we see the energy that you bring, like how is it just to be you right now, be in your position with the music you're making and just the scene? I'm just, I'm excited, man. Like really, like this is my first time ever performing at a Power 106 event, headlining, you know, and that's, that's crazy to me. So I just want to have a good time. You know, I want to get out there and I want to put on a great show. Now, you know? I want to talk about the Young Money album we heard you guys got in the works. We see such an eclectic group of individuals and artists that come together. Is there any fighting over who gets what track or who's going to work with who or who's going to collab? Nah, I mean, actually, like, we, um, we, Wayne just, I talked to him, actually seen him yesterday. And, um, you know, he was like, whatever songs you got, send them over. Because, you know, our schedules right now, everybody's torn. You know, everybody's doing this, doing that. And, um, you know, it's basically like he has his own songs that he wants us to get in the studio together. Then other than that, I have my ideas. I'll send it to him. Drake, I have ideas and send it back or, you know, vice versa. So. And besides that, what about this movie? I heard y'all are all starring in the movie that Wayne's coming with. Like, y'all have oh, little yeah, bits yeah. and pieces. Um, I don't really know too much about it, but it's Birdman. Yeah. You know, they was famous for doing yeah. the movies back I in the day, Baller Blocking. Yet. Yeah, but I mean, he said everybody's basically just going to be their character. He ain't going to you know, Birdman, he don't want nobody doing outside of their character as an artist or anything like that. So it's going to be good to just see all of us on there, you know? And off of Careless World, I know you got so much music. Oh, your, your artist, Honey Cocaine, she just dropped something as well. Wish you on it, right? Yeah, yeah, she definitely here too. She um She's working on her new mixtape, 90s Gold, so. And how is it for you to, as an artist coming up or just making yourself, establishing yourself to help other people out? Because you could really be greedy right now and be like, yo, it's all about me and my world right now. But you really choose to help other people out, bring other people with you. I mean, I think that's what it's about. Like, you know, you see, you, you, you go back, you know what I'm saying, in the early 90s and you see all these dudes, they was winning. They was together. They was in photos together. They was in movies together, videos. They was in the studio together. And a lot of people are afraid to do that sometime you know because people feel like people feel people are afraid of competition and, and like I, I don't I'm not worried about competition or you know somebody overshining me or me overshining somebody I just want to have fun because I started doing this for the love of music and that's what it's about at the end of the day we're all doing this because we love to do it you know what I'm saying and that's what some people forget like you know you started this in your room recording you know what I'm saying started you wasn't getting paid to do no shows you wasn't getting paid you know, it was, off of, it was, it was off of the love and the passion. So, I mean, when you got that, it's like, I'm just having fun, you know? And when I first heard of you joining my, like, Young Money, I got to tell you, I thought out of the whole group, out of the whole pack, you were going to be the bad trouble guy. And it wasn't you. We got our little Drakes and our little Young Money, like Nicki Minaj riffs going on. But, like, y'all, you keep the peace. Like, how did you kind of be the one to be like, yo, like, I'm just straight. Like, I don't need to cause this much trouble. No, I mean, that's just how I am. I just learned, like, I learned that early, like, just being um, on my own and, like, teaching myself how to be a man and just, you know what I'm saying, be smart and be strong and, and be able to try to make it in this in this industry. You know what I mean? I just realized, like, you know, certain things, you know, like, people are always going to attack negativity. You know what I mean? And it's like, they're not going to attack the positive things you do. So the more negative stuff you do, it's, that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like... I'm just want to be, I'm, I really just care about my fans. I just want to be focused on my music, really, you know? A couple more questions. Like, we like to see how Birdman really takes care of you guys and has y'all together. I feel like y'all make all make a move together. Y'all have each other's backs and kind of ride for each other. How is that, being in some something so amazing like this family that is Young Money? I mean, it's, it's dope, man, because, like, um, you got help, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, and if I feel like I ever get to a point to where I'm stuck, like, you know, how should I play this move? I could always call Nikki. You know what I'm saying? I talk to her a lot. You know, I can I can hit up Drake or I can hit up um, Wayne. You know what I'm saying? Even outside, like, Chris Brown. Like, that's like my brother. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I got friends and family that are successful that are there. You know what I'm saying? And the help is there. So. Can't wait for that collab mixtape, by the way. Y'all and Chris. Well, and your yeah. Double one, your second 
We're actually about to do Fan of a Fan too, so we're about to start working on that.